Boing Boing teamed up with Institute for the Future and Sun Microsystems to create the Digital Open, an online tech expo for teens 17 and under around the world. Now meet one of the winners. Uh, Eric Chin and I'm 16. Uh, Rebecca Shing and I'm 17. David Chow, I'm 17. Kathleen Liu, 17. Raymond Zong, I'm 17. So this year we've just been working on this device. We have called it Skittles. Um, reason being is because the spine of helium balloons along the middle is very colorful. We went through a lot of names before we actually settled on Skittles, or more precisely, I settled on Skittles. <laughs> and they just kind of like came along with it. Right. This is Skittles in a second. We were doing a routine kind of test flight outside of Raymond's house, but um, we didn't do any fail safes, and we were flying, and an updraft caught it, and it flew away. Later on, we actually found out our device turned up about three hours drive to the east. Two thirds of the way to Yosemite already. <laughs> when we heard about how far it was, we basically looked at each other and said, road trip. <laughs> I am the only one who can legally drive other people around as of now. We initially started off with the idea that if we were to use an airship, it would have to be light. But the real weight determining was how much our electronics would weigh. And so we decided we'll use two blimps because we calculated the lift capacity and two was sufficient. And so then we proceeded to try to make everything else as light as possible. And so first we decided on carbon fiber for the frame. We decided on, you know, propellers for propulsion. And this is basically store-bought small foam airplane motors here. We could not find a commercial speed controller that would suit our needs, in this case being be able to run in reverse. And so we basically hand soldered, yes, uh, the speed controllers, which are these guys up here. Uh, we use a standard LiPo battery here that's dual locked on there. And right now we're thinking about upgrading this. These two up and down will control the motions of each individual propeller. And in this case, on the back, we have a we have vertical set of buttons. So it's up, down, basic, left, right. I heard that just last week, the US Army is gonna be deploying a hybrid airship to Afghanistan. It'll be saving lives, basically, because we don't have to send soldiers in. I think my piece of advice would be, it's your life, so do with it what you will, basically. Um, don't let anybody else control or dictate what you should do. And um, please, do try this at home.